Grayson County school leaders are pushing for change with the new superintendent and finance director. School board members recently passed a budget for the upcoming fiscal year, including pay raises for all teachers. This is a sharp contrast you might remember from about a year ago when we reported the district was a million dollars in the red. WS Close 10's Duke Carter explains how that turnaround was possible. Parents who have kids in Grayson County Schools have said they have seen an improvement from last year. Emotionally, I feel great. We're, we're excited. The community's excited. Tracy Anderson is a parent. He says compared to last year's school's budget, he feels content with this fiscal year's budget, but remains skeptical. The idea of, of a lot of new things being added and improved, at the same time, a year ago, our school couldn't afford toilet paper. We're really excited about our budget. Grayson County Schools Superintendent Kelly Wilmore says this upcoming budget is about $20 million, which is about the same from last year. In the budget, it includes a 2% raise for all employees in the school system. It also covers the 13% health insurance increase, plus two new art positions at the elementary school, and some slight renovations like locker room upgrades and painting the walls inside classrooms. We're pretty excited about uh, uh, our high school is long overdue for some renovations. They, it, it, is, uh, it is definitely uh, in need. Wilmore says the reason for the turnaround is that they're getting more money from the state. This year, Wilmore says they're getting over a half a million more. It's not a inflated in, uh, by any means. The county was pleasantly surprised to see that the school system passed their budget so early this year. And county Administrator Jonathan Sweet says this gives the county ample time to work on their budget. Sweet says despite last year's budget problems, the county feels more optimistic about this year's budget. Uh, we feel that the budget presented to the Board of Supervisors this year is uh, much more accurate. In the end, parents are hoping the superintendent's budget will help students in the long run. He's got a pretty big wish list. In Grayson County, Duke Carter, WSLS 10.